Hi, my name is Ray Chambers and I'm from Lodge Park Technology College in Corby, Northamptonshire. Now, what I'm going to show you in this lesson is how to edit the speech recognition and how to use my example so that you can play around with it a little bit yourself. Now, if I go down through my code, you'll notice that I've still got things in here such as detecting your gesture. So, uh, you can put in your code here so you can experiment with it. So, if your hand goes to the right, then you can carry out this function. I'm going to skip way past this and go straight down to the important bit, which is to the speech recognition. If I go right the way down, the first thing that we need to stop at is grammar.add. Now, this is where you add in your own functions. So, I could have grammar.add. I'm going to put my name, Raymond. So I've got red, yellow, and Raymond. Now if I go further down, you'll notice here I've got red, yellow, and whenever they are said, basically I'm telling it to say hello and goodbye. So I might say, you've just said red. Uh, I could say, you've just said yellow. You can also mess around with the confidence so if it's finding your accent a bit funny uh, you might want to lower it a bit so I might put 70 for red now I know the other thing that is said is I want it to detect Raymond so what I've got to do now is I've got if red said I've got if yellow said I need to add the next one in so if e result dot text dot to lower equals Raymond and the result is a good match so confidence is greater than or equal to 0 0.85 what do I want him to do I want it to say I want a message box to appear welcome to the program Raymond now let's see if this works so I'm going to run it I'm going to enable the connect. Raymond. Yellow. Red. 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 So, as you can see, it's not foolproof yet, and it still has uh, some issues with accents. But that's what you play around with the uh, how close you get. Um, I could lower this even more to maybe improve it and see if it works any better. So I could say uh, greater than forty. So let's see if that works any better. Red. So you can see that was a lot better at detecting what I had to say there because I had to lower the accuracy of it. But you could have a play around with it and see what you could come up with. Maybe you could add four different uh, words in for your program. Uh, feel free to download uh, the sample files and play about with it. I hope this has been kind of useful uh, because I know a lot of people have had trouble since the SDKs switched over. Uh, if you'd like any more information, uh, you can go on my blog, raychambers.wordpress.com, and also these lessons are available by joining the PIL network, uh, which is pil-network.com. Okay.